Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to be sharing my top 5 fall must-haves for moms and children on the go. I love taking my children to pumpkin patches and local farms and just getting outside while the weather is still not too cold. And there are several things that I've learned over the years that I cannot live without that will make your mom life a little bit easier this fall season. I would also like to thank my sponsor of this video, Germbub. They are a family-owned company that make these really neat little wristbands that dispense hand sanitizer, making it really convenient for moms and children on the go to keep their hands clean, sanitary, and bacteria-free. Before we jump into this video, I wanted to welcome anyone who is new here. Um, on my channel, I'm all about joyful motherhood, natural living, and an orderly and peaceful home. And I love encouraging mamas to invest in their husbands, children, and to make their homes just a really beautiful, cozy place for their families. And I would love to share in that journey with you. So if you are interested in that, please make sure you subscribe to this channel before you leave. And if you enjoy videos like this, please leave this video a like and let me know what is your number one fall must have in the comments comments down below. So my first fall must have is the germ buff and it's just this little silicone bubble of hand sanitizer that sits on your wrist and it has a really small opening on the side where you attach a nozzle to any hand sanitizer and insert it into the germ buff to refill it and when you need to dispense it all you do is swipe your hand over your wrist and you get a nice little amount of hand sanitizer to clean your hands with. It works very well and it's a nice quality silicone and it's very comfortable to wear. It's very soft, stretchy and the size is adjustable. It is available in several different colors. My favorite one is this white one. And as a mom of two toddlers, I think this is a really great thing to have because you just strap it to your wrist and you're good to go. There's no need to go searching through your diaper bag, which is probably overcrowded as it is trying to find a small bottle of hand sanitizer. It's just very accessible right on your wrist, which I think is really great when you're like at a zoo and done petting animals or it's time to have lunch or after they played on a playground. It's just very convenient to have it right on my wrist because it is something I use every single time I'm out with my children. I think this is also a great thing for school age children because if it is strapped to their wrist they're much more likely to use it and fight unseen hand bacteria and viruses especially during the cold and flu season by cleaning their hands between classes or if the restroom should be out of soap or before eating lunch if it's something that they are always seeing on their wrist they're much more likely to clean their hands with it also really quick tip hand sanitizer is really great at getting tree sap off of skin and off of clothes whenever my children are out playing on the playground they always get it on their hands and it can be a real pain to get off but with a little hand sanitizer and a wipe it just rubs right off and for their clothes I just like to dispense a small amount and rub it into the stain and then throw in the wash and it comes out like new. It can be a really sticky mess but with a hand sanitizer it is no problem at all. Anyways I think it's a really great little product and it's nice that you can refill it and use it over and over again. So for those of you who are looking for something like this or interested in learning more about them I will have the link in the description box below. In the colder months, my children always get chapped face and dry hands and I like to have a balm on hand, something that is natural and gentle so that it won't make their skin red and sting. So I always try to go with something that's more organic and with natural ingredients. And instead of water-based lotions, I like to go with a balm or a cream, something that is really rich that's going to deeply moisturize their skin and also help it to heal faster. Item number three is rain gear. Now here in Oregon, raincoats and rain boots are an absolute must. We get so much rain during the fall season. Whenever we see a muddle puddle, my son always has to jump in it and the rain boots will keep his pants cleaner and his feet dry. But even if you don't have a super wet fall where you live, I still recommend rain boots because they are very easy for the child to get on and get off by themselves. Marcus and Chloe are constantly going in and out of the house. So as long as we 
keep boots by the back door and they know the rules. They have to have shoes on to go outside. Our carpets stay a lot cleaner in the house, but also they're really nice for when you go to other people's homes or whenever we go to like a harvest festival, they have to take their shoes off before jumping on the blow up structures. So it's just so much more convenient to be able to slip the shoes on and off than unlace them and tie them back up every single time. recommend is a bento box. My children love these so much. We've had them for over a year and every single time I pull them out with their packed lunch and if we're out at a playground or the zoo they are still so excited to open up their bento boxes and go through their lunch. My kids get so distracted when we're out and about but having these little bento boxes make meal time a little bit more exciting and they're much more likely to sit still and eat. They're also a good challenge for me as a mom to get a little bit more creative with what I pack into them them with the compartments I always try to fill them with something different and I think the kids really appreciate the variety as well the fifth thing that I recommend are gummy vitamins during the cold and flu season we like to I'll eat really healthy but also to supplement with some gummy vitamins and the three types that I like to give my children right now are a multivitamin some probiotics which are really good for the gut have so many amazing benefits and then also an elderberry vitamin which will boost the immune system So I know I said there were going to be five tips, but I do have one bonus idea that I think will be really fun for the fall season, and that is to have a basket that I like to call the rainy day basket. This Inside of this basket, I just put crafts and little toys and stickers and stuff like that that only come out in a rainy day when we're cooped up in the house and things are just getting a little bit chaotic. I will bring this out to either calm us down or just get the kids busy with something fun and special. I have a lot of ready-made craft supplies in there that they can just pick something to do, like some boxes that they can decorate with rhinestones or googly eyes or feathers. And I also have some paints and we've painted rocks before. So what I like to do is go online and find some fun craft ideas and just put everything needed for that craft item in this box and it's something that I can either give to the kids and let them do alone or it can be something fun that we do as a family to pass the time. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed that video and found it useful. Thank you again to Germbub for sponsoring this video. I will have a link to their product in the description box below. Please don't forget to go and check them out. I hope you're all having a wonderful fall season and I will see you all very soon in my next video. Bye everyone. Oh, 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 oh